Welcome. Please take your time. Despite being in a spirited race to the capital with Shingen, Kenshin somehow managed to defeat the Oda army at Tedorigawa. Meanwhile, Shingen encountered difficulties of his own with the forces of Ieyasu Tokugawa, but emerged victorious as well. Having both been delayed, Kenshin and Shingen arrived at Sekigahara at the same time, where they would once again challenge each other. The dragon of Echigo and the tiger of Kai, the day to determine which would rule the land, had finally come. May the heavens guide my sword to slay my nemesis. Chapter 5, Showdown at Sekigahara. Great Bisha Mountain, victory shall be ours. It is only natural that we are forced to fight again. Indeed. You're like a bad case of the scabies, Kenshin. Come then, and let this be our final battle. The enemy encampment lies before us. We must seize its center if we desire to win. We shall seize Sakigahara. Do not let Shengen get the best of us. I see you've made the first move, Kenshin. I expected nothing less from you. Allow me to meet you head on. The great Mount Matsuo will control the tide of this battle. And Atsugu! The army of Takeda will splinter before our power. Let our world know the strength of USV. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth. Second wave, advance! Take the Northwest Garrison! Will this finally mean an end to the battles between Lords Kenshin and Shingen? If so, we must give our all to ensure Kenshin's victory. May the gods show you mercy. I bow to your skills. Destro skill against my experience. They're here. Open the garrison at Mount Nongu. Stop the west of the May the gods show you mercy. None can stand before justice. Lord Kenshin is truly divine. Show 
you mercy. I bow to your skills. Such prowess We cannot let this opportunity escape us. Third wave, attack! Sako, tear the Uesugi army to shreds. Potential. Show me what you got. If winning a battle without fighting is the epitome of strategy, then isn't it impossible to perfect one's tactics on the battlefield? If you doubt the perfection of my abilities, why not put them to the test? <laughs> God show you mercy. You're even greater than I imagined. <laughs> May the God show you mercy. None can stand before justice. Lord Kenshin is truly divine. May the gods show you mercy. I bow to your skill. God show you mercy. None can stand before justice. Lord Kenshi is truly divine. Sakon has left the battlefield. Can't take much more of this. Oh, no, no, no. Ah. 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 
Sir, you feel that way. Question is, how will you deal with it? After the battle at Nagashino, Lord Shingen moved to seize the road to the capital. Along the way, he also fought with Iarasu. Now he has made an ally from that former foe. Lord Shingen is truly amazing. Come, if I defeat you, what does that make me? Might overcomes even the greatest strategies. May the gods show you mercy. Greater than I imagined. I am Ina. Know me and you shall know pain. May the gods show you mercy. None can stand before justice. Lord Kenshi is truly divine. The fate of the Uesugi closes in upon them. Constant fighting instilled fear in you? Never! I will do whatever it takes in the fight to maintain honor. Good. In that case, follow me. I show no mercy to those who take enjoyment in war. I will end your madness here and now. May the gods show you mercy. Such prowess in combat. The next time our paths cross, I will emerge victorious. Enemies at the main camp! Send reinforcements! A battle with my nemesis. I know no greater joy. I must now develop my strategies to their fullest extent.
May the gods show you mercy. None can stand before justice. Lord Kenshin is truly divine. Failure. is now. I will defeat you to realize my ambition. Test your skill against my experience. I shall be your opponent. Do not disappoint me. Show you mercy. I bow to your skills. <laughs> <laughs> Amongst death, magnificent. My blade thirsts for enemy blood. May the gods show you mercy. Such prowess come. May the gods show you mercy. None can stand before justice. Lord Kenshin is truly divine. War does not belong to the gods. It lives firmly in the realm of men. Face me, and I will continue your inferiority to me. I am eternally in debt. 